I get to control her day. And guess what, guys? Today you're getting a tattoo. No, no, no. Oh, you got to the left. I've always wanted to work on a farm, and while I'm in Hawaii, why not try it there? Who? <laughs> if you saw this video, you know that I am going to Hawaii. Guys, I'm traveling along the first time ever. Look at this. And lucky enough, I'm not sitting by anybody. I'm just kidding. But isn't it weird that the editor got me this vacation? He's not even coming with me. And I swear to God, if I come back home and my house is a different color, oh, you guys are gonna have to get him. Let's go to Hawaii. This is my third time to Hawaii, so third time's a charm. We just walked to the rental car place. I don't know what it is yet, but it's slot 27. See what it looks like. Who knows what it could be? It could be a truck, it could be a tiny car, it could be a huge car. Okay, wait, this is 32. That is... 38. This is 27! The perfect! Yeah. Freaking amazing! Oh my god! Look at how the things like her old cheek! This is literally the best thing I could ever ask for. And it's so windy and also hot here, but it feels so good. Now we have the car. Let's go see where we're staying. We made it to our room. We have a cute little ocean view. It's beautiful, actually. It's really, really, really beautiful. So I'm eating some food because I'm low-key kind of like starving. We have a kitchen, which is so cool. Look at how freaking cute I made my closet. You ready for this? That's all the clothes I brought because like I'm probably gonna be in bathing suits most of the time, so I oh, have my shoes down here. You wanna see bikinis? They have to go in my bag. Bikini! There's a food truck place really close to here that we might go tonight. Maybe I'll vlog. Maybe I won't. I'm at my first grocery store in Hawaii and they have a new flavor of kombucha that I've never tried before. <laughs> I'm so happy. They also have this green one that I really like a lot. It has like chlorophyll and stuff, so we're getting some of these. One thing I love is shopping in different places because you find such amazing things. I'm trying to like get, you know, like Hawaiian stuff. This coffee is 30 freaking dollars, but I'm getting it for real. Look at our car, it's full. We're literally here for three days and then we go to the next place. Hawaii is literally known for all their rainbows, so I thought of a cool game. I saw my first rainbow! Let's count how many rainbows I see while I'm here. So we've taken like a ton of photos today, but we're at our last destination to finish like at least like four more photos, I think. We are going to this place called the Mermaid Cove, and there's a turtle sister here, it's super cute, but we're actually legitimately walking in the middle of nowhere. I have these high shoes on that I keep breaking my ankle, legit. But the good thing is, is they don't have any snakes mm -hmm. in Hawaii. So like, me walking, I don't have to be worried about snakes. <gasps> And I'm like a freaking human that loves the ocean so much but can't go in it because I get an awful allergic reaction. My body, these are weird, they're like scratches. But I have to, we have like a kind of a hike back. So, here goes nothing. The second rainbow. We've seen two rainbows so far. And we've only been here for like only one day. Obviously you can't go to Hawaii without going to a luau. Ooh, coconut bras. Actually, unfortunately, I didn't see any coconut bras or any hula dancers. I love luau's. I've been to two so far. Now this is my third one and we're gonna see if it's my favorite. My makeup is still my same makeup from today, but I made it work. I'm wearing a red dress and my mom and I are matching, so it's amazing. That's right, I got my makeup on and I got my red dress on tonight. All right, that's the third rainbow. Right, third rainbow? Yeah. Comment right now how many rainbows do you think we're gonna see? Off topic, I something happened to my eyes and they actually look kind of good. Like, I just like my I eyes. Think just my eyeballs. Like, they look pretty, don't they? Yeah. I don't know where I did. We just made it to the Luau. We made it perfectly in time, like perfect timing. We didn't have to wait or anything. We literally, so my grandpa's birthday is 627, so he gave us the 27th seat. And it's actually just my mom and I. Usually when we come to Luau's, we had to sit with like a ton of people, like random people, but we're about to get this like salad thing. And I'm so excited, I'm so happy, I'm so grateful. It's so beautiful it's so here. So and I feel like I'm very overdressed. Koi 
butter and look at how beautiful it looks. So we have a ton of staples here and we have this amazing salad that I'm going to take a fat chunk of and put it on my plate. Oh my God, that looks so good. Dinner is served and they have this sweet potato stuff and I just took two. I love sweet potato. And then we're taking one of these. And then I kind of want to see what's going on over here. What's this? This is some cabbage. Oh, it smells good. So we actually went to Maui and this is my second time going to Maui. It's one of my favorite islands on Hawaii, but again, I haven't been to all of them. Maui is like known for the road to Hana. Guys, we're on the road to Hana right now and there are pigs on the side of the road. I'm gonna go try to touch them. Where did they go? Did they leave? Yes, 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 I'm crossing the road. Oh my God, it's so cute. Look at it, it's right there. It ran away. There's just random pigs. There's a pig in here. There's two. Did you hear it? Oh, I love pigs. So you guys know that we've been taking photos for like the past few days and I had a bet with Ashley actually because you know we all need some motivation to keep going and keep working really hard. So I said Ashley if you don't have all the photos done by the third which today is the third that I get to control her day. And guess what guys she doesn't have all the photos done. She had one more photo that she needed to get done so that means that Piper gets to control her day and this girl there's a lot that I can do with her. I could give her a whole makeover, I could throw her in the ocean, I could make her swim with sharks, but I think I have something really cool in mind. Okay, so I have so many things that I can do to control her life, but I think I have the perfect idea. I was just looking at myself and I was like, I actually have way more tattoos than Ashley does, because guess what? She doesn't even have one tattoo. So I was thinking that I was going to bring her to this tattoo shop and let's get her a tattoo. She loves these like hibiscus flowers or whatever, but Ashley is low-key kind of a wimp, so I don't think that she's gonna like wanna do this. It's gonna be kind of like stressful for her, but she's always talked about how she wants a tattoo, blah, 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 but she's just too scared to. That's why me, I'm gonna swoop in and just throw her in there, why not? Let's just say next time you should definitely get your photos done faster because today you're getting a tattoo! Okay, Ashley, so I have Gabriel here with me today, and he's one of my good friends, and I told him to actually give you a hibiscus tattoo because I know that you really like them, and of course I want to be nice, but also kind of mean to you, so I have to do something kind of nice. So you're getting a hibiscus. Oh, I love hibiscus. But you're getting it on your butt. Is that okay if you get it on your butt? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but not, it's not a joke. <laughs> Is that your reaction? Did it start? Are you still alive? Yeah. She didn't even feel it. Good she didn't I mean, I feel it, but it wasn't bad. Looks very nice, matches your shirt exactly. We got one more rainbow. I think that might be four rainbows so far. I've always wanted to work on a farm and while I'm in Hawaii, why not try it there? So I actually volunteered at a farm. Hi guys, okay, so today I'm actually, I have an off day, I don't need to take any photos or anything like that, but we're actually at this farm sanctuary and they have tons of cats so I'm gonna feel like I'm at home they have a donkey pigs cows all day so we're gonna go help out volunteer do something good for the world because you need to put your energy into good stuff and if you have time to go on someone's page and hate it's just put that energy somewhere else make this world good because that's all we can do I want to see your peacock cock, 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 your peacock cock. is yours my peacock or my peacock I don't know if I could get any closer This porta potty smells like bleach, and there's nothing in the toilet. Usually, the, like the last porta potty I was in, the poop was sticking up so much, and if I sat on the toilet, it would have touched me. So don't mind me; I'm gonna piss myself. Right now, I'm cleaning a guinea pig cage. I used to have some guinea pigs, but you know, it's definitely more difficult. There's the cutest cat here. I'm in love with him. It's kind of it. Poop. I gotta remove 
all the poop and pee and then put the fresh stuff down there. Cage, I actually found a whole little group of eggs, so that's pretty cool. Breakfast tomorrow, right? Real quick, look at this guinea pig, y'all. Literally looks like a hippie guinea pig. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen. Next thing I'm doing, I'm pulling some weeds out, and the weeds go in the barrel, and then some stuff actually goes to the guinea pigs and to the deers. So, pretty self explanatory. Right now, we're feeding the guinea pigs and the deer. This is the stuff that we just pulled up. <laughs> Long day at the farm. The lady teaching us was kind of weird. I wish I could stay there for longer, but now let's go see where the next day takes us. We're back from the farm, and I want to give you guys a little MTV trip tour. Oh my god, don't be so close to me. Okay, so first of all, this is our kitchen. We actually cooked dinner in here last night. I have all my amazing snacks in here and just really amazing stuff. A new kombucha flavor. Boom, boom, boom. This coffee, literally most expensive coffee, 30 freaking dollars, but I enjoy every single bit. It's like, it's like Mother Nature's pee or something. Then we have a living room. Stop getting so close to me. And we have a cute little like, um, this is a life size room sea turtle, but it's also a basket. We have a TV in here, of course. We have our bathroom, which I actually am not gonna take a shower in this shower. I don't want to shower. I don't think it's necessary. I'm at the beach. I basically am going to clean myself every day in the water, right? You're wrong because they actually have an outdoor freaking shower. Well, the first time I ever had an outdoor shower was at my 15th birthday and I loved it so much and I've loved it since. So anytime I get to have one, I am just ecstatic and taking a shower is amazing. Then we have my amazing home. We have a cute little bed. I have a little vanity. I also have a... I also think is so cool is we have a bunch of surfboards lining up the wall. We might go to the beach real quick and then we're gonna go to dinner. That's kind of it guys. Number five. I have sand all over my lips. I just took a nap on the beach. Now we're gonna go to dinner. So like I said, we're going to dinner and we're at this really, really amazing place that actually you have to book like 18 months in advance. A year and a half ago. Our bread's coming. Somehow my mom and I got this, and this place is called Mama's Fish House. So we'll we'll put it to the test. I'm so freaking lucky. I'm like gonna cry, legit. Oh my god. The boat. This is the main course, and so far so good. It looks really amazing. We got some apple bananas, which I've never had before. I'm gonna try it myself. Tastes like an apple banana. Oh my god. That's beautiful. The last thing, dessert. So I'm gonna put my phone down, enjoy this last moment, and just realize how freaking lucky I am. See you at home. So we're at this black sand beach that we actually were at a few days ago and my mom left her shoes here. So we're gonna go see if her shoes are still here after two days. This place is like a local spot or whatever. It's kind of rainy today. Let's go see. Are they there? Looks kind of rugged it today. I just stubbed my toe so badly. She left it right by this tree. It's like they're not here. I just struck my toes so badly. Did you see? No, there was a spot in the road. Right there. Number six. It's currently like raining really hard, 
but there's a rainbow like right in front of us. I don't know if you guys can see it. So that's number seven. Number eight, and that one's probably the best one yet. It's so freaking bright. It's officially our last day, and time to say goodbye to an amazing house, the amazing outdoor shower. I had an absolutely amazing time, for real. And now it's time to go wash the Jeep up, and it is really dirty. Let's go wash the Jeep up and get on a flight. I hate going on planes. And again, guys, I just want to say thank you so much, and I've really come to the realization that I'm here to create for you guys and I just want to create new things for you and that's you guys have given me such amazing opportunities that I feel so guilty that I don't provide you the best content ever but if you want to find more content please go to my snapchat I'm posting literally so much on there and yeah go check it out okay I'm at the airport I am super tired very stressed the jeep was very hard to clean but now we're about to get on our plane and the only thing I'm concerned about is if my dog's gonna be excited to see me do we think he's gonna be excited I don't know we're crossing our fingers, and you guys better cross your fingers too. Finally, we're back from the flight home. I hate flights so much. If there was one thing that I never have to do in this whole entire world, it would be take another flight. But it's time to see if my dog actually missed me. My doggy doggy dog. The moment we've been waiting for, I'm finally home. We're gonna see if my dog's actually excited to see me. Please answer my prayers. Please answer my prayers. Like a human hug. I missed you! 